He must have hated him so much. Robert had that effect on people. Yeah, but Lawrence, I just can't picture it. Maybe that's because you were picturing someone else. No, it's because he's an old man. Right, and how hard is it to pull the trigger? I wouldn't know. I'm just saying, stuff like that happens to Robert for a reason. And what reason would that be? You reckon he deserves it? I bet I'm not the only one thinking it. Oh, and you've been such a great influence on him, haven't you? You hypocrite. Tell you what, when he wakes up, he's going to know who his friends are and aren't. What's all that about? I'm just saying, what a family, eh? Lachlan, his mum, and now Lawrence. Lawrence! Hard to believe. Well, the police believe it. Has he definitely been charged? He's confessed. Doesn't mean he did it. All right, well, you sit here being all open-minded. I'm going to go and visit our brother. I wonder if you wanted to come. No. Andy, please. It'll do him good to know that you've been. It'll do you both good. The only thing that'll do me good is Robert not waking up. <laughs> no, what he needs is for you to get him out of there before he goes crazy. Well, and we can't make things happen any quicker. I... OK, well, I, I will see what I can do then. Thank you, Rakesh. Chrissy, there's a very weird rumour going round the village. Where's your dad? He's not answering. Will you please tell me what's going on? Dad's confessed to shooting Robert. But he, he's only done it to protect me. What do you mean, protect you? Did you shoot Robert? Well, then you need to talk to him, get him out of there. Your dad cannot be in prison. Thank you, Bernice. I'm aware of that. He won't be able to handle it. Well, Rakesh says there's nothing we can do while he's still making threats. What threats? Who's he threatening? Robert. Oh, my God. Look, Bernice, I've got enough on my plate without these amateur dramatics, OK? Oh, you don't think I've got a right to be upset? I know you're fond of Dad. More than that. But this is about family. Yeah, well, I was going to be family. Me and your Dad, we were going to get married. We'd just been on a day trip into the Blue Mountains and... It was just one of those days, you know? It was just perfect. The sky, the view... And he just asked me. And I just knew. You don't approve. You know, your dad was desperate to tell you himself, mm. but... Please don't say anything to anyone about the engagement, especially not my mum. Not sure how it's all going to work from now on. I'm seeing him later. Why don't you come with me? In fact, you could make him see that he stands to lose more than just his freedom. Don't panic. You're perfectly safe. See? No cricket bat. And I haven't got a gun either, despite what you told the police. I want to know, please, did you ask your father to do this for you? Or is it just a, an understanding? Chrissy is uh, untouchable. Chrissy gets away with murder or attempted murder. You know I didn't shoot my husband. My father didn't either. And yet, he, he's taking the blame. Anything to make sure that his precious little girl doesn't suffer. My father's in jail. My husband is at death's door. I mean, in what way do you think I'm not suffering? In a killing Valerie and not taking full responsibility kind of way. Don't worry. I'm going. Wouldn't like anything unfortunate to happen to me. Before you start fussing on, I'm OK. Well, you don't look it. You look terrible. My daughter's never been one to gild the lily. <laughs> Should I assume that the uh, cat has been let out of the bag? Well, I've told Chrissy, if that's what you mean. There isn't going to be any cat or any bag unless you stop this nonsense right now. I'm afraid I can't. Of course you can. Just tell him that you're lying. I'm not lying. Yes, you are. Aren't you? Yes, yeah, he is. This isn't some kind of joke, you know. This is my stepbrother we're talking about. I know this isn't how we saw the next few weeks panning out. I... You're acting as if this is some kind of unexpected business trip. Think about what you're doing, Lawrence. I have. Well, then stop it and tell the truth. Don't do this, Dad. I don't know what you want from me. What kind of relationship do you think we're going to have? I sit around in the village, waiting to visit you each week, while you're in here gradually going nuts. 